pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay. First item on the agenda is the approval of the minutes of the October 24th and November 4th meetings. We have had a chance to look at these minutes. Anybody have any, any corrections, any additions? I will, real quick, uh, we approved the October 24th meeting minutes in our November 4th meeting. Did, was that not part of the... I wasn't at the meeting, so... Did we not see? I don't think it was on the agenda, was it? It wasn't, but Linda added it just because we were here and we figured we'd go ahead and well, approve them. News to me. Need was to approve them again? Yeah, well, was it, it was that, a, that was a special meeting, wasn't yes. it? You better approve them. Okay. You better approve them again. Okay, well, the motion would be then to approve minutes for the October 24th and the November 4th. So moved. Second. Mr. Beaverspot? Yeah. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Wade? Yeah. Okay, and we have uh, under fiscal business, we have the fiscal officer's report. Or anything? I have nothing to report. Okay. And we do have the current bills. We've had a chance to take a look at the current bills. Does anybody have any questions about any of the current bills? Hearing none, is there a motion to pay the bills? So moved. Second. Mr. Gabbard? Yay. Mr. Meterspaw? Yay. Mr. Wade? Yay. And anything else on your fiscal business at this time? I don't believe so. Okay. Moving into new business administration, we have draft resolution 4959, a resolution authorizing the township administrator to enter into a crop rental agreement for parts of lands known as Harbaugh Park. Yeah. Well, I think you're all aware that we have two pieces of property that we've had farmed since the, they were bought, I guess. I know that we're at the end of a five-year lease agreement with um, Tom Reedy uh, because we have some <clears throat> issues that would prevent the trustees from voting on something with Tom. Uh, his son is a separate entity and it wouldn't be an issue to have it go th work work with his son Adam to do the farming. So this is the same general documents we had before to do the farming. It gives us the ability to end it at any time since we're not sure exactly when and what we're going to do with these properties. Uh, so it's basically replicating what we've done the past five years to Pay us to, to farm the land per acre. Okay. Does anybody have any questions about 4959? So, a motion to approve. So moved. Can I vote on this? Yes. Yeah. Second. Mr. Meterspaw? Yay. Mr. Gabbard? Yay. Mr. Way? Yay. And we also have 4960, <coughs> which is a similar resolution involving the Kitzinger property. Correct. Same, same explanation. Right, a motion to approve 4960. So moved. Second. Roll call, please. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Meterskoff? Yeah. Mr. Wade? Yeah. <clears throat> the only reason I asked that was because right. I live next door to the Harbaugh property. Right. And I wasn't sure where that began and ended as yeah. far as the legalities. Right. Okay, and then also under New Business Administration, we have a firewall security appliance to purchase request for $4,000. This is, Doug had come to me last week with an issue at Station 22, and he boiled it down to the firewall apparatus or appliances, what he calls them, uh, is, is failing. And we had the same appliances across our network at the different buildings, and he suggested we replace them all rather than have, you know, have an issue with them. Uh, he's, he's actually... He's got a spare from Springboro, the city of Springboro, let us use, because he, he works with them. So that was, appreciate that. But this is to get those replaced. Yeah, good idea. Okay, is there a motion to approve this purchase? So moved. Second. Mr. Meterspaw? Yeah. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Lee? Yeah. And anything else under administration at this time, Captain? Uh, no, sir. 
Okay, and the police district, we have resolution 4561, resolution accepting a donation from Enterprise <coughs> EE Products Pipeline Company LLC. Uh, Enterprise has, uh, last couple of years, they've donated money to the police department. I think they've gone out to the fire department. Uh, we keep a relationship with that group down there. There's monthly meetings uh, relative to the fuel depot, making sure that we're all on the same page, that if something happens down there, we've got phone numbers, names, and they go over some of that stuff every uh, month with new issues and so forth. And uh, a gentleman from Enterprise dropped off a $1,000 check we wanted to donate to the police department, so I'd ask the board to uh, accept that donation from Enterprise Products. And, Thank them for doing that. Okay. Great. That's a donation of $1,000, and I should have said resolution 4961. There is a typo. I said 45. So is there a motion to, to accept this donation of $1,000? So moved. Second. Mr. Gabbard? Yay. Mr. Commuter Scott? Yay. Mr. Wayne? Yay. Okay, and we have a purchase recommendation for background and polygraph for police candidates for $3,500 for Ohio Polygraph and Associates. Uh, the police department is still vetting uh, part-time police candidates, uh, and we ran some of them through uh, polygraph and background. Uh, the uh, bills coming for that is above our spending limit, so that's the board to uh, us the $3,500. We used to assign policemen to do those backgrounds, and this is a much uh, more cheaper way of doing that. We're still getting a pretty quality product out of it. So, uh, it's certainly worth what we're doing with it. So, just an authorization because it's above our spending limits. Yeah. And for 49.62, that was. Uh, we need to approve the purchase recommendation for. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's right. We already passed that one. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, it was backing up to the other one. But we already did that. So, purchase recommendation. Uh, for station 22 and 23. No, we need to go back to the police district and approve that part. Part. Yes. As a background and polygraph approval for that team. Yes, sir. It's a bummer spending limit, so I guess they won't approve the police. So I motion to approve this uh, amount so they can continue with their search. So moved. Second. Mr. Meterspaw? Yay. Mr. Gabbard? Yay. Mr. Wade? Yay. And now we have fire district. Uh, 4962 resolution accepting a donation from TE Products Pipeline, just as we did from the fire or police district here recently. Same, same donation. Same donation. Very good. Very generous folks. So, a motion to approve uh, 4962. So moved. Second. Mr. Gabbard? Yay. Mr. Meterspaw? Yay. Mr. Wade? Yay. And we have a purchase recommendation for station 22 and 23 for new carpet. Yeah, this is a project that's been budgeted for this year. You know, it's just normal wear and try on the carpeting and the tile and the kitchen, so we're looking to replace both the outlining stations. Okay, anybody have any questions about this? So a motion to approve the purchase of the coffers. cost of the flooring for from Pages carpet at $15,880. So moved. Second. Mr. Meterspaw? Yeah. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Wade? Yeah. And we also have a storage compartment uh, request to purchase for the Chief's vehicle. Chief? Yeah, this is a storage compartment for the rear of the vehicle. I was looking to do this next year when I was doing my budget analysis, and I came across the used one from Camp Safety that we could save about 40% on the cost of it if we purchase it now because it came out of an older vehicle, so it would fit in, in this vehicle. So okay. bring it to the board because it's above my spending limit. And but it'd be a good opportunity to just do it now and save some money. Anybody have any questions about this? Purchase? Okay, so a motion to purchase the storage compartment for the chief vehicle. So moved. Second. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Meterspaw? Yeah. Mr. Wade? Yeah. And we have the fire district monthly report. Anything you particularly want to point out, Steve? No, no, no. Anybody have any questions for the chief about this monthly report? Okay, anything else tonight, Steve? We did get some good news that the Warren County Career Center is going to move forward with building their uh, fire training facility. It's going to be a five-story burn building. It's a nearly a million-dollar capital investment. So it's going to be in our district, so we'll be able to use that to train. Awesome. And um, it'll also help us with our ISO rating in the future when we get reassessed. We'll get some additional points for that with a no cost to you know, the township. Good deal. That's great. Okay, moving on to the zoning department. 
like to set a date for some public hearings? Yes, sir. There's, it looks big, but it's going to go fast. Um, two part big camp hearing request for text amendments and two for zone change requests. Looking to have this set for December the 12th at 5.30, if you want to all go. Okay. Set, okay with everybody, December the 12th, 5.30, so just have it before the meeting. And that's not perfect, or first thing on the meeting. Yeah, first thing to approve. Move it into the right spot. Okay. Is there a motion to approve uh, the public hearing for December 12th? So moved. Second. Mr. Meterspaugh? Yeah. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Wood? Yeah. And we have your monthly report, Jeffrey. Yeah, I can answer any questions you have about the monthly, sir. Anybody have any questions for Jeff about the monthly report? Busy. Yeah, we're back up in numbers. Yeah. Anything else, Jeff? Not this time. Okay, road department. We have uh, first recommendation for herbicide for the three calendar. This is just the annual fall presentation. Anybody have any questions? About the uh, herbicide application. Hearing none, is there a motion to approve the purchase? So moved. Second. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Meterspaugh? Yeah. Mr. Wade? Yeah. And we have the monthly report. Okay, so the only thing I really have to report is the last two weeks we're just getting everything ready for the snow. All the maintenance. So. I like your truck. Thanks. Did you get a chance to look at it? Yeah. Thank you. Everyone we, we've talked to said they, they liked it. So. I mean, Miami Township and everybody that has the same vehicle, so we felt comfortable moving forward with that one, so hopefully we'll have the same luck they had. Oh, true. Okay. Anything under staff updates at this time? No, sir. Okay. Uh, we do have an executive session plan. I guess I'll have to read all that. <laughs> executive <laughs> session plan, uh, and we'd like to have, entertain a motion to recess the regular meeting and through resolution 4963 authorize an executive session to consider the appointment employment dismissal promotion demotion or compensation of a public employee and to consider the sale of property at comp at the competitive at competitive bidding or the sale or other disposition of unneeded obsolete or unfit for use of their property. This is our motion to approve 4963. You, you may note you're amending. I'm amending the agenda for right. this resolution. They added a lot more. So moved. Second. Mr. Meterspaw? Yeah. Mr. Gabbard? Yeah. Mr. Wayne? Yeah, I know that's probably not something that our attorney. That's what you paid by the <laughs> 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 <laughs>